Welcome to my YouTube channel. This is basically going to be talking about the Michael Jackson nine years ago today. He passed away. Um, I just every year I, I keep on forgetting. I listen to his music on that day, so on Monday I'm going to listen to his music on my either my, on my records or my cassettes or my MP3s. Yeah, Michael, yeah, the way I found out about how Michael Jackson was, well, at the time he was in a coma, my nephew t texted me saying MJ is in a coma, so then later on I found out he passed away, passed away, 2.16 in the afternoon, then after that. We're getting reports of his death around the internet and MTV started playing his music I think the same day or the all day next day on MTV BET or VH1. I was mostly watching MTV. Uh, uh, eBay blew up with his, with his stuff. Jacked, everyone jacked, jacked up in price when an artist dies. Is either is his items go up in price, his album sale shot up and Sony release Sony release stuff and there was a memorial week after that like a nice memorial to like when someone passes away you have to remember all the good things like like his music Everyone was playing that music, talking about the past when Michael was living about. I, I do not know. I cannot. I think one of Lionel Richie, Diana Ross, Elizabeth Taylor, another one who passed away between that, and musician playing his music. And there was a lottery about my two Facebook friends who just went to the Safer Center in LA, LA. I couldn't do it. Um, it I, uh, I could, I could, but I don't know if, if I would have gotten a ticket for it. I would, would have taken the ground down and see him or hit a ride with someone. That was sad. The emotional for me at at the end of of his daughter Paris cried. Well, of course, it, when a parent passed, you you sad and distraught. I feel bad about her. She well, she she grew up with her dad. Well, in the spotlights. Well, she had her face covered when she was a baby. With a, with a brother prince and, and blanket where well, Michael Jackson the third <laughs> they call him blanket I don't know why they call him blanket for um, um Michael did want them in the spotlight so good thing about it one of my first albums I heard well in my memory in the 80s Michael Jackson thrill on cassette I have to I, I could play this on CD or LP, what I have. One of the best songs on there, Billie Jean, was the first song on MTV for the Amer African American songwriter. Well, Bi Mike wrote Billie Jean and, and I heard the demo version of it. Yeah, um, Mike, Mike Jackson is, uh, was a inspiration in the business of music. If you like rap, metal, rock, or hardcore metal, you have to respect Michael in, in one way, in a lot of ways. He's talent, not as talent as Prince, Prince could play a lot of instruments Michael didn't. He just sung and danced good. Yeah, I think he made then, well, 
Off the old was his fifth, six, seven, eight, nine albums. Total, I think ten. I have to see. Not put the Jackson Five in the seventies. He made, I think, two albums in the seventies. One of them is is has the song Ben on it. I have to look up and put it down in the information thing, but. Yeah, I I grabbed this Master System game when it, when I saw the cheap. Well, it was caught only, so I just played. I got this in in this bookcase. I got this like his all the some of his magazines I saw on on yourself. I think there's more magazines out there. I have to look for. Yeah, Michael Jackson was big in the business. Everybody loved him. Everybody to now, 2009 to 2018, between then, everyone passed away. Elizabeth Taylor, Prince. Yeah. That what, and, well, one of his last albums was Invincible. So. That's what his studio album. Sony releasing two more albums after his death, and then in October, I saw it in the movie theater. This is it. Behind the scenes of his final tour. It was it was sad to see about the King of Pop. Who, King of Pop, back backstage room. Then after that, well, in two weeks, limited run in the movie theater, you know it's gonna do well. I got a D, I got, I got, this is it on the blue, Blu-ray DVD, I got the soundtrack and I got the uh, steel, steel case book, I could put the Blu-ray disc and the DVD in there to watch it. Got. Moonwalker 2 on VCD, video CD, DVD. Well, of course, it's 4x3. It's not six. I don't know if they made Moonwalker in 6 and my 9 X as best ratio. Spec ratio. Um, yeah. And. Uh, uh, I don't have any more Mike Jackson games. I should have bought this Genesis Moonwalker earlier before 07, 06 when it was really cheap. I didn't now. Nowadays, video games are go going up in value. I should have, yeah. But I didn't. I like, thank for let me ramble and like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what was what's his distant memory of Michael Jackson listening or just watching his videos or your memory when when he passed away 2009 or were you guys in 2009 when he was passed well what I'm saying is what's your guys opinion where were you guys when he passed away in 2009 Alright, thanks for watching.